Starting in the last part of April or the first part of May, beekeepers in my area are often called to capture and remove swarms of honeybees. Usually the one queen in a hive increases her egg laying in late winter and populations begin to grow in early spring. And then along with the increased nectar flow and availability of pollen as the weather warms, the colony begins to raise new queens so the hive can divide and multiply. Swarms are normally docile with just one queen. I'd say 90-95% of swarms are no problem, but none are exactly the same. These kind of swarms are pretty easy. You just cut the branch and put it in a ventilated box of some sorts, and then you can take them where you want to put them in the hive, all the while being careful and watching in case you see the queen. There she is. Now I found her. That makes me feel pretty good. Problem is, there's a second one there that I haven't seen yet. Just a sign of things to come, I'm afraid. I put the queen in with her bees and finished dumping the rest of them in the hive. And I saw her again, so I grabbed her and... Oh, and, no. And then I see the second one. Three queens. Yeah, and then I see a third one. This could be a problem. Now there's a third queen, or, well, I don't know, maybe that one's a third queen. I obviously have more queens than what I think I've got. I come back with my first two queens caged and find what I think to be the third and the last queen. As I head back to the truck to look for another queen cage, the queen I'm not aware of yet walks around on the edge of the hive. It's really odd to me that there's been no piping between the queens, and I... Also can't help but wonder how many times this has happened that we don't see because we usually dump bees and hives with frames. And I'm getting ready to proudly display my three queens. The camera catches that fourth queen that I haven't seen yet right under me. So here we go. Third and what I believe to be all of the queens. Son of a gun. And then I see the fourth one. And I'm heading back to the truck to try to find another queen cage. <laughs> here, look at what's crawling here. Another queen, number five. There they are. All four queens. All of them. Almost hate to find any more. I think. But I did. But then I spot the fifth one. There we go. All five. Finally. And you know, it makes me wonder, looking back on all those swarms that I've been so proud of catching and finding the queen, thinking I had everything under control, I... You know, I've seen queens, and sometimes I've seen a queen more than once. Uh, like this one. There's the first time, and, and the second time, and the third time. And several minutes later, she was outside on the entrance of the hive walking around. But uh, now I'm not really sure. Sometimes if I do see that one queen in that swarm, and am I seeing one queen of two or three or four? Five or I don't know. I'm not saying that it happens that often, uh, but I think this happens a lot more than we realize. 